Rachel. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing something a little bit different for you guys today and I'm going to show you guys some of my favorite dupes from one of my favorite stores, Aritzia. If you are like me and have an addiction to Aritzia, I'm sorry. It definitely breaks your bank. Their stuff is kind of expensive, like not designer level expensive, but definitely expensive for the high street. Um, so I want to show you guys a few of the dupes that I got compared to some of the stuff on the website and also one that's kind of vice versa. So, aritzia.com, my love. Okay, so fun fact guys, I worked at Aritzia for one moment. None of this stuff was at the store when I was working there, so I'll try to be my best to be impartial. But the first item that I found is this teddy crop jacket. This comes in both a red and a other color. Um, which is this like camel-ish color. Let's see if it's here. Oh, there you go. And the one that I have as a dupe is my trusty old Shein Teddy jacket. I've had this for over a year now and I absolutely love it. Um, the one thing I have to say is that the shape is a little bit different than the Aritzia one, but the Aritzia one will cost you $178, whether you're in the US or Canada. I don't think this costs more than $50. I'm gonna have the real price right here somewhere, but I wear this absolutely all the time. Wear this all winter last year, I absolutely love it. So the next thing here from Aritzia is the Buffin Pant. This is a really cool jogger. It came in a cream color. So the pair I'm wearing is the dupe. They are from Zara and they were about $60. So the Buffin Pant here on the website will cost you about $125, while this one will cost you $60, so about half the price. This one has like cargo detailing on the sides, but I don't mind that too much. I think either way you get a pretty good bang for your buck because joggers are something you'll be wearing absolutely all the time. I'm actually really proud of myself for this one. Wilford is one of the house brands under Aritzia and they have something called the Brion Pant and it is a knit pant that they kind of come out with every year. It's kind of a culotte style, a crop length. It's very, very casual, like you definitely wear it with sneakers, but the way the model has it here is with a pair of sock boots and a cardigan. So I think they're trying to like gear towards like the work crowd. So a few weeks ago I went to Koss and these originally are $115 made out of a similar material. So only about 20 bucks cheaper than the Brion pant at Wilfred, but these were 50% off. So I ended up getting them for around $65 and they are very, very similar. Let me know if you guys find them similar. I think that they're super similar. I think this is a definite, like probably where I save the most. Wilfred Free, which is another house brand under Aritzia, has something called the Gwyneth sweater. And I find that these half zip sweaters are very, very in this year. And if you guys have watched any of my thrift hauls from last year, you will know that I was very much into this whole teddy, like half zip type of thing. And I'm really proud of myself because I managed to get one at the thrift last year. This one is actually an old Gap sweater, but I'm gonna link some affordable dupes that are actually like on sale now in the description box below. But the one that I found is just kind of oversized. It zips up. It's made of this like teddy-ish fabric and I'm obsessed with it. I think I got this for less than $8, which is insane in comparison to what the Gwen's sweater retails for, which is 138 bucks. I think I nailed this one, guys. I really like it. So one tip is definitely check out the thrift for any affordable dupes, especially in the men's section, because that's where I found this one. So I have one pair of denim here. These are from another house brand by Ritzia called the Denim Forum, and these are the Marianne Flare Jean. So they come in a jean color as well as a black denim. And I've been looking for a pair of flares and I actually went to Ritzia, tried these on, and my friend, she is great and super honest with me, she said that they didn't look flattering. And I think it's because of where the flare hits right at the knee. But I found a pair that's actually pretty much almost half the price and definitely a lot more flattering and it is this pair from Topshop. So if you guys know the Jamie jeans from Topshop, you know they make your butt look good, they cinch you in at the waist, they are just like one of the best selling jeans at Topshop and they decided to do them in a flare version and I got these in a size 2630 and they fit really well and I love the cut of them. I think that these are a lot more flattering on my body type and plus I got these for around $70. So again, a lot cheaper than the Marianne Flare jean and I just love the way my butt looks in them. I think they're very, very flattering and definitely a trendy staple for this fall winter. And you could save that $70 and go for sushi like 
two times. And then I had to give an honorable mention to the Teddy Cocoon Jacket, also by Wilfred Free from Ritzia. It is $228. Teddy jackets are really in right now, which is definitely why this one is back order. You guys need to get this now because you can get it for half the price. So I got this one from The Gap. And it's so soft, I'm obsessed with it. So this one, it was actually retailing around $200, but there's a 40% off coupon on the Gap right now. And then on top of that, there's an extra 10% off your purchase. So this ended up being half off. I think I paid around $130 total with my tax and shipping and everything, but that's definitely, that's $100 less than the Wilford Tight Cocoon Jacket, and it definitely gives you the same look. And it's definitely around the same quality. I love the gap and I think it's great. So definitely pick this up before it's too late because I think it's a really good deal and they make a great, great jacket. And then this one is kind of a reverse. Um, this is kind of like a dupe for something I already have in my closet that I happened to find on Aritzia. Um, but it is this sweater called the Kitano sweater. Now, Babaton sells it for $110, but it is a wool blend sweater, which is probably why it's a little bit more expensive. The only thing is you'll probably have to hand wash this item because it's wool blend. But see this crisscross in the back? I have a sweater just like this that I got four years ago from Aritzia, and it is like pretty much the exact same sweater. Um, a lot of you guys ask me about this all the time because you always ask me where I got this from and I never like really have an answer because Zara never brought back this style but it is literally the exact same sweater guys. So guys, that was my little research project into Aritzia dupes. I wanna definitely do more dupe videos, so let me know if you guys like this and which brand I should investigate next and show you guys some really good steals and get the same look without having to pay that big budget price. Or if there's any specific items you're looking for a dupe, DM me on Instagram, follow me, comment, send me things, let me know because I will be on the hunt for them. And with that being said, guys, I am going to go. I hope you guys enjoyed this one and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye, guys.